so this is the website the official website and once you are here um this is the official website you agree to the terms look at it the official website yes so don't forget so you agree to the terms welcome back to my channel guys so today i'll be walking you through the process of registering for the n power program 2020 so let's get right into the video hello please click the red subscribe button below this video to get our latest video updates and then click on the bell icon to get notified each time we create something new thank you my just celeb tv so for you to register for the Empower Program 2020, you need the following documents. First of all, your degree results. Um, and the Empower is for both graduates and non-graduates. So if you are registering for the for the graduate program, I'm talking about the graduate program now for the educated uh, ones that want to register. People that don't have degrees can still register, but this video is specifically, is specifically made for those that have their degree results or OND or HND and all that. So you need your, your degree results one, you need your NYSC certificates, you need your means of identification, which is maybe your permanent voter's card, international passports, driver's license, yes, or the the name, the names, the names, a national identity card, yes. And then you need your passports, yes, and your BVN, your BVN number. So um the first thing you do is so here we are on my system um so this is the website the official website and once you are here um this is the official website you agree to the terms look at it the official website yes so don't forget so you agree to the terms you agree to the terms and you click on apply for empower program apply for empower and then they'll ask you for your email address and your password. So for this, um, I'll just use any email. And then for the password, you can just type anything. Um, just type. Please make sure your password. Um, let me create some new password. So. Um, So you can create a password that is very that's not easy to track. Showing you this so you can know how to treat your uh, so you can copy this and then put it there, you click on register. So you get this registration successful, so click on login and then you put your password and then click on log into the portal login successful so now your verification identity verification you need to verify that the first thing you do now is to put in your bvn your, uh, sorry I, I already did this registration and i have only one bvn and i just wish there was maybe i had two bvn or something the only one person you can only have one bvn but once you click here and then you go to you click here and you put in your date of birth it will immediately take you to your bio data and contact where you are going to put in your name your your personal contact your name and all that and then it will say that sometimes your bank verification number is not um it can be it can be verified automatically so you put your details manually so and then um the other place i want to point out for you in this whole process of uh, empower program is that um when they ask you how much you earn per month please don't put a big amount don't put a big amount you can just put maybe ten thousand naira or eight thousand naira or five thousand just put something small and then when they ask you for the amount of the number of people that depends on you uh like relatives or family maybe you can put maybe five or three or something because this empower program is actually meant for unemployed graduates it's a scheme to help unemployed graduates so you don't try to make yourself look like a big person uh, to them in a little automatic disqualification and then uh, when you get to the final stage of um submitting and reviewing you should make sure that you save the last number that was given to you the last details that was given to you there then another thing that i still want to point out for you is uh go to you make you try to make sure you visit the official you follow 
the official website of um, NPower. So you can know, um, sorry, the internet is a bit slow, so you can know the latest updates from them. I wish I was aware there was like I get another BVN, so I can just put you. You have only one BVN, so I have only one BVN. So with that BVN, your name and your details will be displayed. Then uh, the official handle, Instagram handle of BVN. The, sorry, the official Instagram handle of um <laughs> this guy <laughs> of um the official of Empower. Please don't get it wrong. If you search Empower, different a lot of options. Uh, this Nigeria NG, there are two, and then these two. So always make sure you get it right. Yes, this is the I'm already following them. This is the official this and then this again. There's one that has no, not this. This one is wrong. Please don't follow this one. There's one that has it's something, it's it's K followers or so. Not this one. This one is wrong. So because a lot of people are following lots, but this this is a this is this is one of the correct handles that they have. Because this handle was just created. this is one of their correct handles for 2020. Then there is still another there is another handle. Because if you check these things, these things are there is another handle that you see I can't even find the handle again, but Guys, the first handle that, that is displayed, this one, M underscore, M underscore Nigeria, is, is, a, is another, is a correct and legit one. But you cannot apply from this link. If you click this link, you can hardly apply. You can't get anything. You can hardly get anything from there apart from information about um, the Empower people and how they do their stuff and all that. So, um, this is the link. I've, I've, I've told you the link. This is the link. This is the link, and uh, once you copy the link and you paste the link, direct, straight on direct, accept the terms, and then you click on apply, and then you get right into it. Don't try to register this on your phone. That's the mistake a lot of people do. Try to go to a, use a laptop or maybe a desktop or use a computer. A lot of people don't know the website. The website is this. This is the official website. It is not an affiliate link. I'm not getting anything if you click on the link. It is the official website that was released by the NPower official uh, website and they are through their Instagram handle, which I will still link. I'll put in the link. I'll put the link of the Instagram handle below and then i'll still put this link below so i would like to give you a few hints number one most time this site is very slow right now because a lot of people are clicking on it so um if you click most times it will roll and roll and roll and maybe it's not login so you just keep trying you tr i tried um a lot of what you do is you, you can still try um at midnight if you even go midnight you can try in the afternoon um or you can try any other time like just try to schedule it differently so um once you click and then i'll advise you if you click and you use a particular email make sure you don't use the email you use if you register for the empire program before don't try to use the same email you used previously use a new email and if you use your email and they, they tell and you put your passport and, it, and your password and they tell you wrong password Try and they said they will send a link to your email. You click on the link, click on the link for them to send you a, a an email to reset the password, and you don't see the link. You just forget about that email and get a fresh email. So, guys, another tip, another tip, guys. Uh, please do not pay anyone in, uh, upfront for Empower registration or for anything. It's it's online. Yeah, I mean, everything is online. And once you register successfully, they will tell you that they will communicate you. The next step or the next uh, thing to do and then make sure that um, when you're using your phone you're trying to put your phone number it's good to put two numbers two numbers so that it may be there is if there is network issues and they couldn't reach your first number via SMS or via call they can still reach you in your second line yes then the third tip is uh, your documents must not be five more than five MB they always state it there make sure that your documents are less than five MB before you upload them and then get your the edit documents ready your passports uh either on a black uh, sorry either on a red background or on a white 
background. And then um, when you are trying to put your address, your residential address, try to visit um, this website, this website, NigeriaPostCode.com. Use this website and locate where you live. Locate your local government and your particular uh, postal code. So you can put the postal code there, your address and your local government. Don't just put your address there and leave the postal code empty without doing anything. Just use this this address, NigeriaPostCode.com is free. Log in, locate where uh, you stay, the state, the local government, your area, and then you get the postcode and then you can put the postcode there. And then what, just like I said earlier, make sure that every time you are registering something, not just empower anything at all, you have your email, you should have your email open on one on one tab and anything you input on that site save it on your email anything you put on that site save it to your email and when you finish you can send it to yourself so you make sure that uh, you don't forget any of the details for those that use one password for everything that they do online anything that they register one password it is a very very unhealthy thing because once someone cracks that password every other thing is gone and I don't think it's even healthy to use one particular password in all your uh, re online registration or anything like that. So um, then uh, Empower has several categories. Please make sure you go through the categories and read about them before you apply. Uh, some, some are meant like the health. The health uh, category is meant for those who study things about health, uh, nursing, medicine and all that. You, can, you can't study estate management that you go and apply for N health. Uh, then for, there are still things like for tax. At the, the end tax end tax is mainly for people that study the social sciences management sciences uh, economics and all that so try to know your category then uh, there is mbo there's end tech so you try to know the one that fits you well go through them and know the one you apply for now that it is still hot <laughs> so guys uh, i hope you enjoyed this video. i hope it's useful for you to get through the registration process at least you know you now know the direct link and then some of the things to do uh, to be successful. So there is no assurances that um, anyone is going to be picked. Mm, there is no assurances, but I wish everyone luck. So um, and I pray they do it well and not just true. I am just as we have been experiencing earlier in Nigeria. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you like this one, if I, if this helped you, give me a thumbs up on this one. But if it did not, sorry, and I hope. Um, I will do help you next time. If you have any question, if you have any question, tell me, ask me direct questions. You can ask me direct questions on the comment section so I can reply. I will reply you immediately if you're having any difficulty on any part of the registration process. So thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time. Peace out.